Okay, so now I've got Simone with me and we are headed to Prada so that we can go to the exclusive launch of the 3D configurator for the Prada bag. So essentially, we're going through the journey on how to create your own Prada bag. And I think that's so exciting. Very exciting. And I'm so happy to have her here with me so we can do that. Okay, let's go. Let's go. You look so beautiful, Simone. Oh, you look so stunning. Oh, wait, I changed my outfit about three times. so beautiful. <laughs> Me too. Like, I kept messaging Simone, like, okay, I'm gonna wear this now. And I'm like, I'm gonna wear this. And mind you, we've been, this has been in the works since February. No, before that. Yeah, it's, yeah. Been, it's been brewing for a long time. A very right. long time. Right. Like, all of our choices of fabrics and color, please feel free just to have a look at them. So, could you please explain a little bit more um, what you meant by the 3D configurator thing? What, what's that about? Like, just so I understand. Of course, no problem. Because okay. I this think it's a... very exciting. And thank you so much for inviting us. No problem, always a pleasure with you. And this is the our 3D Apple configurator. I'm okay. gonna explain you before how to do that, how okay. to use it. So you can use it um, and you can play with it. So basically, since this pop up, the aim of this pop up is to make you order your own bag. Make your own Prada bag. Make your own Prada bag with personalization as well, which is something super exciting that we yes. launched this year. So this will be the app, so a very, I would say, easy to use. Okay. You can choose between three Many. sizes. <laughs> so, <laughs> would you, you for sure? <laughs> would you go a little bit? Many, yeah. And then, of course, you see it's very well detailed. You can literally play with your bag, see every inch of it. Wow. Okay, so you can choose by material and color, and you have loads of options between exotic leather, so let's say within Coco Drow, you have loads of colors. <laughs> wow. You have the Malaya Pocodrops or you have the uh, I like that pastel pig, the alabaster, alabaster pig. pig. That's okay. quite cute. Alabaster. Oh, that's so nice. It was a bit to know your, your style and your size. So is this in the Sofiano leather? This is in the Sofiano leather for the first time uh, we, we launched this pop up. Yeah. Our like uh, um, degradé leather. Yeah. Otherwise you have the crystal and this one exclusive. Your new exclusive. And this one will come with oh. the silver hardware. Oh wow. It is beautiful. We it's never had this one before. <gasps> Look at that. It's, really it's amazing. Okay, so once, let's say, if we've made the selection, what happens after that? So, you do edit personalization, and yeah. since we already choose material and color, what about choosing the logo? So you have different types of logo. You have the Prada and the and the leaf side for just a, so pretty. Just wanna decide to keep it a bit more discreet. Because if you don't want the logo to be well, like yeah, yeah. out in front, that's perfect. This one is targeting those of our clients that doesn't like maybe to have the logo too much yeah. like centric on the back. Very inconspicuous, yeah. I love that. Or like uh, the opposite. Oh, that's yeah, there's two kinds of people. Two kinds that. of girls. Two clients, oh, nice. you're going to have this one. So a very shiny, beautiful, just to announce a that you have an Himalaya I've arrived. <laughs> it's my yeah. I'm arrived, yes. <laughs> there there I am. Not my style, but I, I, it's nice. I can appreciate it. Yes. Or the silver. The silver's nice. This what one is the nice. first one look like? Is that just the normal, the original? This one I will I like be... That, yeah, this one will be the real classic Prada. I like so. classics for me. I, 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 I prefer this. You prefer classics? Yes. Yeah, it's, it's a bit going to be like very timeless. Yes. Otherwise, you have the... That is nice. Very it's up to you if you prefer, like maybe to have the detailing in gold or silver. Yeah. They're up there. Yeah, exactly. I mean, silver and pink is always a must, so it's yeah. beautiful also like yeah. this. Yeah, especially to match the hardware as well of the rest yeah. of the bag. And plus, the Galleria has always been made with the gold detailing. We never had one before. So this app gives you the opportunity to also have the, your Galleria with the, the uh, silver uh, detailing. Mm -hmm. Let's say, which one was your favorite one, girls? Or oh, what's your favorite? The classic or I like the pink one. Let's side, go with the pink so. on the side. Yeah, that's different. Let's go with the pink, pink on, on the, the side. side. Okay. But we haven't finished yet because okay. we're gonna have another type of personalization because this is really going to be your bag. So we're gonna edit it and then you can add your initials. This is if we were to put the personalization on the inside, it would be there. Absolutely, it would be exactly here. Wow. So, and you can also so pretty, you can color. also you can also come yeah since we like pink we love pink so pretty <laughs> I love can this color there you are it will match with your outfit yeah, 
we call this color alabaster alabaster oh so the one that we chose over there was like the alabaster crocodile i think the crocodile yeah think so alabaster. it's absolutely similar similar so to the same pretty. thing as that crocodile one with it Oh, we love it. We love it. We love it. And you so it would either be imprinted here, yes. embellished here, or on the inside. You can and this is the classic logo. Very pretty. Very pretty. I love it. You can either choose maybe to put uh, like a message, or like um, for uh, a wish you love the Christmas. Some oh. of the client did that because if we start ordering now, for example, the bag, it might arrive to you in December. Okay. So perfect for, uh, for Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. Okay, so now we've seen how to make your own Prada bag, which I think is so exciting. We're now going to afternoon tea. That's what I've been looking forward to. Oh, I've been looking I've forward to oh. up an appetite. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even have breakfast. The most I've had was um, the truffle chips at the um, champagne bar. Okay, we're in the cab now. And I'm just so excited. We've just had like such a long way to catch up. Can't wait. Months in the making. Months in the making. But I'm so glad we got to see the um, how to make your own Prada bag. You know, and seeing like the, the variation of price. I think versus the leather, the Himalayan, Himalayan crocodile versus yeah. the Sofiano leather was like a difference of twenty thousand. I think. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> that was, wow. That was a lot. But I mean, to each their own. <laughs> Whatever is your style. Go with that, you know, if the budget fits. <laughs> it's or if you're just going for the shade. It's the shade. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. Like I I think whilst the um alabaster pink crocodile skin is beautiful, I, I personally wouldn't spend twenty four thousand pounds on that. No. No, I'd rather go for the Sofiana leather. Yeah. Agrees. A lot less. <laughs> Significantly. Exactly. We made it to the wrist. Woo! Now we're going up to the after you, darling. <laughs> Champagne of teas. <laughs> Do you know why it's called the Champagne of teas? No, please tell me. So it's because it's, it can only be called Darjeeling if it's grown in the Darjeeling region of India. Ah, I see. Um, like Champagne, it can only be called Champagne if it's grown in Champagne in France. Perfect, thank you. That's the similarity. I'm your host for today. I must ask, would you like some milk? I would love some milk, darling. Oh, Thank perfect. you. Perfect. Just a dog. Just a dog. <laughs> just a dog. <laughs> I should also have just a dash <laughs> of milk in my champagne tea. Oh dear. One of the things I think is my most favorite about tea drinking is the way that you you stir it. I think I put a little bit too much milk. I put more than a dash. <laughs> <laughs> it looks white. <laughs> More than a dash. <laughs> They're all going to think they were coming for us. Thanks, guys. <laughs> oh, I love that. 
Now there's the uh, never-ending debate of whether you do your clotted cream and jam the Cornish way or the Devonshire way. Now I do it the Devonshire way, which is contrary to Her Majesty, who does it the Cornish way. So what I do is I put the clotted cream first and then I put the jam, just because I feel like it's it just makes it so much easier and less messy. Whereas when you put the, the jam first, I, just, I don't see how that would work. So <laughs> I'll show you how I, how I do it. Yes. Um, can we actually get that to go, please? Like a yeah. box? Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you so much. So I've got the clotted cream. I'm going to nick your... Um... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Treating me. <laughs> I've got the clotted cream first. And then I go in with the jam. <laughs> Wait, this is how I do it. Yeah, this is how I do it. And then I put a little bit of jam and I just dollop it on top. And that's the way, that's the way it's done, I think. That's the best way to do it. Delightful. The face says it all. Satisfied? Completely. <laughs> Alright darlings, that is all for today's video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a big like and subscribe to see more.